Infectious diseases is a critical field for the health of our community and our nation. We are seeing unprecedented amounts of emerging infectious diseases, and we also have brand new diagnostic techniques that make our ability to take care of children more accurate and beneficial. There's so many opportunities to create something that's gonna change our world. So one of the distinctive features of our program is that we have the whole range of pediatric infectious disease activities. Whatever the fellow is interested, we really accommodate that, and we can because we have a training grant and we have over 25 very, very skilled training mentors. So if you like research more, you can divide your clinical year so that you do more research starting from the first year. And if you're more interested in clinical, then you can do the opposite. You start as a first year fellow where you might do between three to six months of in-service time. By the time you're a senior, you're pretty much the one in charge and also helping the junior fellows. It has been a great learning experience clinically as well as in research-wise. There are many opportunities that the fellow can take based on their interests. I chose Columbia because it has a wide variety of clinical experience. Um, you get transplant, you get a lot of cardiac patients, complex patients, um, love tertiary care in addition to your general bread and butter ID. For a fellow that comes here, uh, you can work in lots of different areas all under the, the umbrella of our pediatric infectious disease program. So you're not limited to pediatrics per se, you really have the facilities of the entire medical school at your uh, disposal. This is one of the only schools in the country that has a medical school, a school of public health, a dental school, and a nursing school all within a campus. Because you can reach across the university, across the medical center, uh, to form members of your own mentorship team, uh, it's one of the great strengths here. So you get to access all that Columbia University gets to offer in addition to the New York Presbyterian Hospital. So it's a really good kind of combination of clinical experience and research opportunities. If we look at how, how people have done when they finish our program, they are, almost all of them are either directors of fellowship programs, running a lab, that are involved in public health and scientific research. We've had fellows who've gone into uh, public health roles at the Centers for Disease Control. Uh, we've had fellows who have gone into industry as medical directors for industry-related trials or uh, pharmaceuticals. And they each find their own path um, in terms of exactly what their interest is. New York City is such a diverse international city and we see a lot of international patients. So you really get to train and learn from the most complex, interesting cases. When you're not busy working, you have so many options, food and museums and you know parks that you can go to. And I think that's just as important as where you train at, having um, good outlets to go to when you're done training. This is a great program to be a part of and a great place to do fellowship, primarily because of the people that you're around. Everybody is thoughtful, engaged, um, and brings diverse perspective. We really want to make sure that fellows are supported as they start to experience Pete's ID in a very leadership kind of role. And we want to make sure that they feel like they're part of the ID family. One thing that is very special about our department is the accessibility. So we always run cases with each other, ask questions. The fellows offices and the faculty's offices are all together. It really facilitates mentorship and education. Everyone here in this program is really approachable. So shoot an email, set up a Zoom call if you want to have that face-to-face -face time, and ask the burning questions and make sure that you get a satisfactory answer. And I think that will really help you to make your decision.